Hi, my name's Ruben and I'm the course director for Virtual Presentation Coaching. So over the last few weeks and months, every single presentation you've had to deliver has been delivered like this, hasn't it? Uh, over VC. And that's fine, you're a great presenter, you've got great content, all that's changed is your audience are in a slightly different place. Um, and that's fine, but that's actually really important, that change in where the audience are. And here's why. We're 30 seconds in now. Have you been focused on me exclusively for those 30 seconds? I doubt it. I'd love it if you were, but I doubt it. And I wouldn't blame you. You've probably had pings, you've had alerts, you've uh, possibly had a second screen going on. There might have been pets in your room. There, there may well have been children needing you, requiring your attention. And that's the difference. That's the big change. And that's a change that we as presenters need to take into account when we're creating and delivering content remotely. Now, they're not huge changes. The fundamentals, as you'll discover, stay the same, but they are really, really important. They're really important if we as a presenter want to do ourselves justice when we present remotely, and they're really important if we as a presenter want to ensure that our messages land with our audience. So what you'll discover is we'll talk about brevity, we'll talk about authenticity, we'll talk about energy, we'll talk about passion, we'll talk about um, engagement. But most of all, we'll practice, we'll present and we'll get feedback about how we've presented in a remote environment by our audience who are also in a remote environment. And by the end of it, you will have become a remote presenter par excellence.